Hi there! Happy Loomness Day! In this video, I'm going to teach you how to make the Starburst Rainbow Loom Bracelet. Bam! Get excited because so many of you guys have been requesting this and I've been telling you guys for at least a couple weeks that this was coming soon. And it's here. So before we get into the video, please click like and subscribe if you enjoy my videos. And after you're done watching this, please check out my entire Rainbow Loom playlist if you enjoy Rainbow Loom videos. If you're on this video then, I would think you like them. Now, without further ado, let's loom it up. To begin, I'm going to take my loom and spin it so the arrow is facing away from me. You want to make sure that the pegs are staggered so the middle peg is further down than the side too, like this. Then you're going to begin putting on your border color. Take a band and put it on the middle and first left peg. Then another band and place it on the first left and second left peg. You're just going to continue by placing bands all the way up this side of the loom. Once you get near the end, you're going to stop at the second to last left peg and place a rubber band from that one to the middle. Now we're going to repeat the same thing on the entire right side of the loom. So take a band, place it on the middle peg and up to that first right peg. Now from the first right to the second right, and the second right to the third right and just keep going until you get to the second to last right peg and then put your final band from the second to last right to that last middle one. Now it's time to start making the stars so they can burst. Before you do this you might want to push down all of the black bands that you've already placed just to make these next steps easier. Take a band and put it on the second middle peg and over to the right on that upper right peg. Now you're going to move in a clockwise direction with the next band. So it's going to go on the middle peg and on that lower right peg. Then take it from the second middle to the first middle on the bottom. Then the middle to the lower left, the middle to the upper left, and the middle to the third middle or the upper middle above it. You're going to do this exact same thing with your next star. So you want to go to the next empty middle peg and place a band from that middle peg to the upper right peg. You're going to always do it to that upper right peg first and move in a clockwise manner. So you can see I'm doing middle to lower right middle to bottom, middle to lower left, middle to upper left, and middle to top. I'm doing the same thing for the rest of the stars. With one loom you'll have six stars total. So I'm working on the third star and then I'm going to switch my camera angle just so you can see the entire loom and here I'm working on the fourth star. Every time you start at the same peg and work clockwise now that all my stars are done, I'm placing my last band and I am going to now place some capping bands. I'm taking a black band, making it into a figure eight or infinity shape and then folding it over so it's in half. So it should have two loops. It's doubled up so you can place that on the last peg. Now you're going to make a capping band for the middle of every star. So you'll need six more capping bands the middle of the dark blue I'm placing a capping band, then the medium blue I'm placing a capping band, again on the light blue and on the dark blue, medium blue, light blue again. Now the capping bands are placed and it's time to start moving the bands with the hook. Stick your hook down through the black capping band and then you're going to pull that dark blue band out and onto the middle peg. Now we're moving counterclockwise so I'm going to reach into that middle peg and I'm going to pull out the bottom right band and pull that over to the bottom right peg. Now we're going to reach in the middle and pull out the upper right rubber band and pull it over to that peg. You can probably guess we're going from middle to top next and then middle to upper left and middle to lower left and there we have our first star formed. Make sure you're really careful when you're pulling these because sometimes they slip out and that's not good at all ever. 
Moving on to this peg right here, we're going to reach in and grab that medium blue colored band and pull it to the middle of the blue star. Remember, push down bands if you need to to make it easier so they all fit. Again, we're going in a counterclockwise pattern, so we're going to pull from the middle to that lower right, then the middle to the upper right, middle to the top, middle to the upper left, and middle to the lower left. And then we're moving on to the light blue star. So you're going to repeat this step for the entire rest of the bracelet. Just form the stars the same exact way you formed the first star and the second star. Once I have the final star complete, I'm going to go back to the end of the loom where the black capping band is and we're going to start working on the border. Alright, so for the border you're going to put your hook in that middle peg and just grab the black band that is going toward the left. So you want to take it and move it to that left peg, the first left peg. Then at that peg you're going to grab the black band and move it up to the second left peg and reach in and grab the black band to pull to the third left peg and keep repeating this up the entire side of the loom. Very, very easy and you're going to pull that last black band over to the top middle peg. And then we're going to do this all over again for the right side. So going back to the side of the loom where the arrows face you, where the black capping band is, you're going to pull out the right black band, put it over to that first right peg, pull out the band and put it to the second right peg, then pull out the black band and put it to the third right peg, and repeat this step all the way up the right side of the loom. Once you get to the end, you know the drill, you're going to pull out that last black band and move it over to the middle peg. Once you're done, you're going to put your hook into all the bands on that last middle peg and then you're going to grab a black band and you're going to want to pull it through all those bands. And then place your hook through the other side of that black band so it is folded in half onto the hook. And then make sure that band is secure on the hook and now you can rip your bands off gently and easily so your bracelet doesn't snap. And then you should have a starburst bracelet. Bam! At this point it might not be long enough for you depending on your wrist size. So now it's time to add an extension. I like to make my own extension not on the loom so I just kind of do it in midair. I'm going to take a black rubber band, stick it through the two loops of this black rubber band, and then fold that in half. Then I'm going to take another black rubber band, stick it through those two loops, and fold it in half to form two new loops. I'm just adding three bands on this side and then adding a C-clip. Then I'm repeating that step on the other side of the bracelet to make an extension over there so the C-clip can be in the middle of the extension. So I'm just putting a rubber band, sticking it through the loops, folding it in half, and then that forms two new loops to stick a rubber band through. And you'll just attach the C-clip to your last band there, and bam, it's a starburst bracelet, and it's amazing, and you did it! Yay! <laughs> I hope this video was helpful. Remember to check out all of my other Rainbow Loom videos in my playlist if you want to make other bracelets that I have done on my channel. Also, please check out all of my links in the down bar, especially to my Instagram, my Facebook fan page, and my Twitter. There are two more Loomness Days left. It's every Wednesday in December of 2013, so let's make them great videos. Leave your bracelet design requests below, and I will try to get you guys some awesome videos very soon. Stay tuned for Crafty Friday. I will be doing a Christmassy DIY, and I hope you guys have a great rest of the day. I will see you very soon. Bye! Challenging bracelets, quote unquote. It's bunny ears hop. The Starburst bracelet. That did not launch. Why won't it do it? This one's gonna work.